Hey guys, welcome to another server miner tutorial and today it's on the blue map plugin. So this is a really awesome plugin which is a great alternative to Dynemap and it allows you to view your worlds in your web browser and it actually allows you to get a 3D look at them and you can effectively just fly around like normal in Minecraft and have a look at all your builds and what people are up to. You can even see where players are in real time, which is very cool. As you can see, it's a little slow to load in places. I haven't been using it too much, but this is the general idea. And there's a few different modes up here where you can get different viewpoints. So the first thing we want to do to set this up is install the plugin and then go into the blue map folder in your plugins folder. And then there's two files we want to edit. We want to go into the chord and in here we want to accept the download to true. If you do not do this, it will not work. So hit save on that. And then the other thing we need to do is have an open port for the web server to work. So in the web server config file, we have the port here and 8100 is the default one. Now we need to set one for it to listen to. So if you have a server hosting company, you can ask them if they have a spare port for them to use. Thankfully, Serverminer has a section on the main page down here for open ports, and it's simply as easy as grabbing one of these to use for that. So now that we've chosen one, we can put the new port in here, so it's 18371, and then go ahead and save. Once we've done that, we can hop in-game. We want to do forward slash blue map reload and that is going to reload the plugin with the accepted download and the new port. So now we can go to our web browser and type in the address. So it's going to be our server address colon the port we chose. So in this case it's going to be videotutorials.serverminer.com colon 18371 then hit enter. And here we go. So we are on the blue map website and you can see I am on here currently and the server is starting to load so then if we go into the kind of first person view mode where you can fly about we can see exactly where we are and what we're looking at which is very cool and then over on the left there's some additional features where you can set different markers and see where people are which is pretty awesome you can see what they're building and then if we go back into minecraft we can do forward slash blue map on its own and it's going to give you uh, a progress update so how much it's loaded and then of course you can not only see your world but also the nether the end and any additional worlds that you have so that is how you would set it up as you can see it's very straightforward it works fantastically and it's a really cool way to see what people are doing on your server without actually being in game so here we are on the speaker page you can see it's updated from 1.13 to 1.9 they give you a demo map to show you what it actually does. But if you need a server to host it on, check out serveminer.com for the best and cheapest hosting around. But that's it for me. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.